Hello and welcome to the Astrology and Spirituality Overview Show for Tuesday the 22nd of December. Elisa, what cards have you chosen today? Today we are using the Tarot de Marcel cards. See what spiritual message comes up for us this Tuesday. It's such a powerful time just now, for sure. Well, that really is complemented by this card, the Three of Wands. We pulled this, I think it was last week. This is about fire. This is about new horizons. It can mean travel. Now, obviously, um, depending on where you live, you may have uh, lockdown restrictions. But we were saying last time we pulled this card, it is about that inner journey. And I do feel more so than ever, it's about finding that fire to push us forward into new pastures. And of course, the... Uh the planet which governs fire above all else beyond the sun is Mars. Mars rules the sign of Aries along with its traditional rulership of Scorpio and in fact the two rulers of Scorpio are in mortal combat today and as they are of course we are seeing a really big surge of a new type of corona, a greater infectivity they're saying. Now these two started to come within three degrees into a square from the 7th of December and that's when the surge has really started to develop and they're going to be in this square pretty well until the 2nd of January so they are on the solar return for next year and that shows that Covid is not just going to go away but what we can do especially from the card that Elisa has chosen the three of wands and the fact that the a combination between Saturn and Jupiter in Aquarius is still so powerful is find a new way forwards and of course at the moment the transition period is not easy the way that it was is being deconstructed in some ways we're not just going to go back to how it was there is going to be a new way of doing things and this in-between period is rather uncomfortable. But that doesn't mean to say that we can't use our human ingenuity, our desire, our determination, the fire that Elise is talking about, to think in terms of our ideas, to find ways to move forwards. And we will. Mm -hmm. There will be a new dawn. Things will get better. And I think Jupiter, which is about expansion, is also about hope. It's true that Saturn can be about contraction, but in the sign of Aquarius, it's about humanity and socialising. So we have a limitation on socialising at the moment. But this new dawn is developing. It's just this week, and particularly today, we're still getting the impact of this very brutal right angle between Mars and Pluto. Mars is about impatience, it's about untrapped fire in a negative way, so out of control potentially, and the power of Pluto. And of course, Pluto can be about what makes way for something new, and sadly, that is what's happening. So it's a transitional period for us all, just at a time of the year when we'd rather be uh, reminiscing, getting together with the people that we really care and love for, but at the moment we do have this big emergency in the world that we're all responding to. So you're all in our thoughts, please stay safe and well, and this is a time to fall back on our inner resources even more to find a way forwards. But for now, uh, please check out your free daily horoscope below. But for now, from the A-team, it is... Goodbye from him. And it's goodbye from her. Goodbye.